Um, yeah, I get completely what you're saying. It's such a shame, isn't it, uh, that they, they had to meet Croatia, uh, really, because that that you know that game uh, against uh, England on Friday night was was um, quite uh, you know quite good, wasn't it? I mean, I, I felt that they they looked good. Steve Clark at the helm, he's a great manager. Are these your thoughts as well? Yeah, it was a spectacular performance. Um, I know England um, suffered a bit a bit of criticism, but we are a young team. We are growing and. Yeah, you know, I believe that there'll be better times ahead. Obviously, that was a big, big disappointment. At, um, losing, losing on our home ground, and you know, twelve thousand fans. I know it's not a full capacity, but we did have all the backing behind us, and we just then um, we we never really played to a, a, the level of the England game, but uh, a very, very fine, experienced Croatian team. I thought maybe the Croatians were. In, in the last legs, you know, of their their careers, but Modric proved differently. Modric always does, doesn't he? He never never stops, really. Uh, I mean, what do you feel now? Um, Steve Clark needs to do. You said, I mean, he's obviously regrouped, hasn't he? A young, fresh sort of Scotland uh, team, a, a Scotland look, really, as well. Going forward, positively, what needs to happen there, Alex, from your experience? Well, I know we've got a World Cup group now uh, uh, to try and uh, get to the, the, the Qatar, you know, next next year, I think it is. And uh, we, we've, we've had a wee set, set back in that group at the moment. We, we've got catch-up to play. But, you know, when you see boys like Billy Gilmore breaking through... And it's such a fantastic game against England. Then you you, you feel that you feel more confident. The, the the big key is Kirsty is that you all your best players are available every single time that we play an international game. That is so crucial to a small nation. Um, if we lose one or two of the the bigger players, then we can suffer. And um, that, that is the key, I think, to successful football. Mm, of course it is. And actually, I just wanted to, to touch on the players this morning and their, how they're feeling. Because, you know, as ever, I mean, they, they were the underdogs. We know that. It's, it's a new era for Scottish football. But they will feel very disappointed, especially with the weight of the nation and that, that great performance against uh, England on Friday. I mean, how will they feel today, Alex? Honestly, I, I I couldn't begin to, to describe it because it is a it's an amazing um, mental feeling when you you lose a game with the, your country or even your your club team and sleepless nights. You know, believe me, we take it very badly, footballers and coaches alike. And uh, but you you know you you do have to go on with things and try and put it behind you and um, look to the future and. And as I said, got um, Steve has a, a young squad, and uh, he, he, you know he can go forward with them.